plant parents. On today's video, i-share ko sa inyo ang aking top 5 best indoor plants here in the Philippines. So first off, allow me to answer why is it important na malaman kung ano yung best for us especially indoors. Well, simply because it will improve our home and also our health condition because it helps purify the air. So here are my top 5 indoor plants available in my house, in my home. So first off, we have the Sun Siberia or Bird's Nest Snake Plants. So this plant is one of over 70 different species falling under the heading snake plant. So yung leaves niya taper towards their bottom forming a petiole which widens at the joint to the stem. Now if you're going to consider to repot a Sun Siberia, make sure to at least give 3 to 6 inches to spread so when the bird's nests become overcrowded naman simply separate them and give each their own pot of container so napakadaling magparami so the only important thing to remember is never allow the water stand in the center because it will cause rot sa ating San Severia. Next is Peace Lily, also known as Closet Plants. They are popular choice for offices and homes. When it comes to indoor plants, Peace Lily plants are some of the easiest to care for. But important thing to remember is that you should never water Peace Lily plants on a schedule. Rather, you should check them once a week to see if they need to be watered. So, this is my giant eh? And this is the regular Peace Lily. So next is the Golden Photos. Golden Photos is known for its heart-shaped green leaves with variegation in yellow which is really very very nice. In the wild, it's known to overgrow forest floors. So I think yun yung kaya nagkakaroon ng mga giant photos. So I might, try, might as well try it. So in good indoor conditions, you can expect the photos to trail 10 feet long. Ang haba! Then photos is particularly fitting for indoor settings because it is able to filter gaseous toxins like formaldehyde from the air. So anong sabi ng air filters? right important thing to remember is that photos is not suited for intense direct sun so a little trivia photos about photos plants along with other aroids like philodendrons which i love monstera also i love and zz plants can it can be easily propagated in water and that's really really awesome guys you should really really try it so next we have the spider plant. So, the spider plant is named because of its spider-like plants or spiderette. So, pag nag-aalaga ka ng spider plants at healthy ang spider plant mo, nagkakaroon siya ng mga anak that dangles down from their mother plant like spiders on a web. So, spider plants appreciate bright, moderate, and indirect sunlight and it is an easiest indoor plants to maintain. The spider plant produces oxygen, purifying the air in your home and office by absorbing carbon monoxide, formaldehyde, and ice saline. So, para siyang yung golden photos. Additionally, spider Which plants safe are not toxic. ating mga anak at sa ating mga pets. So, sabi nga nila, save the best for last. And this goes for my neon photos, one of my favorite. So, sports heart-shaped leaves in a brilliant electrifying green. Sino hindi maiing love sa neon photos? Diba? Tingnan nyo naman kung gaano kaganda. Neon photos is able to adapt to lower light but thrives in bright, indirect light year-round. Tandaan nyo yan, guys. And harsh, direct sunlight will scorch the leaves. While too little light will cause the leaves to become pale green and smaller in size. So make sure if you are able to Make sure that you are able to balance it out when you have these babies with you. So, naalala ko na nagkaubusan ng photos uh, parang last year. Everybody is panicking to have one. So, I'm just so happy to be able to have it and of course, to propagate it. So, there you have it. My top 5 indoor plants. You have, if you are new, being a a plant parent, you might want to start with them since they're not difficult to care for and will surely bring happiness in your home and life. <laughs> to all my fellow plant parents out there, hope you like this video. Don't forget to click the thumbs up and of course comment below. Have a great week. Do catch me on my next video coming up. So take care. Bye!